President Obama came to office four years ago, and we were in a state of economic downturn. And over the last four years, he has done his level best to work with Congress to turn or to stem the tide of what's happening in our nation. He is not the president of the African American community or the president of minority communities or poor communities. President Barack Obama is the president of the United States. He is the leader of the free world, and he has to speak on behalf of all Americans. Surely, we hope that he will address the issues of the least, the lost, and those who are left out, who are disproportionately communities of color, and those who are economically distressed. Yes, we want him to do that, but he cannot do this work alone. It requires the president, it requires the Congress, it requires our state leaders, and it requires our public organizations, our social organizations, and our faith leaders to come together and work together to make this nation a better nation. I think we do a disservice to ourselves and to this nation when, when we put the weight of our economic decline and our problems in our community on the shoulders of one man who sits at 1600 uh, Pennsylvania Avenue. One man in the White House cannot do this work alone. Every American is called to do their part.